We have designed two of the most recognizable airport terminal buildings in the world and have added to many others to create uplifting environments within the constraints of existing complexes. Our concern for simple, efficient and easy circulation and for the whole passenger experience can be seen in the compact but voluminous space of Heathrow Terminal 5 and the dynamic undulating sequence of spaces at Barajas Terminal 4, which was the product of our work with Arabs and other engineers. What we have learnt with almost 30 years of airport experience is that amongst all building typologies, the modern airport is the most susceptible to change. Change frequently compromises the original design so much that it becomes an almost archaeological experience to rediscover the original concept. Having closely followed the evolution of these world-class airports since construction, we believe there is another way, a first for a world airport, a building that can embrace change, dynamically absorbing and rebalancing itself to the unforeseen demands ahead, a building whose iconography cannot be compromised by change, as it is defined by that very constraint. Aircraft manufacturers and carriers are preoccupied by how they can adapt particularly to the rapidly expanding Asian flying public. An emphasis on comfort and personal services, seamlessly from airport to aircraft, will define the success of both. In this context, we cannot underestimate the importance of placing the passenger experience first. Many of today's vast new airports have had little success in making the flying experience less stressful. Indeed, their huge scale is one factor in dehumanizing them. Our proposal for Toyan 3 was the first of a new generation that will respond directly to the passenger, making the process of using an airport less forbidding. I am convinced this unique proposal will become a benchmark for the future admired and copied around the world.